A couple years ago, we made a video using the water jet to spin a skateboard wheel until it stretched and blew up. It went couple. So now we want to try it with a razor scooter with light up wheels, of course, a roller blade slash roller skate, two in one combo, a couple of caster wheels, and of course, the biggest one they had at Harbor Freight. Now that video has been plagiarized and posted all over the internet without credit given to us. So this time we'll be sure to put our watermark in it. That day we had a really expensive slow-mo camera and today it's just our Kronos. The camera we had was rented for a thousand dollars a day. So we're gonna start with the one inch rubber caster wheel and then move on to the two inch polyurethane and then probably do the roller skate and then the scooter and then the big boy for last. I'm honestly, Worried for my life on this one. I don't know what it's gonna do. We're gonna need to get some of those Kevlar plates to, you know. Good to go. All right, we're ready to go. We got our setup and a sheet of steel to hide behind. We're ready to go. It's like super jammed up. I think it's filled with abrasive in the in the bearing. So I don't know. Give us a nice fine powder though. Hey look, we have a spider friend. Pardon me. Well the metal is getting in the way here, so we just uh, removed it. Look at our buddy. Well let's see what happened here. Huh. Oh, yeah, look at that. The bearing is now super tight. It does not roll as easily as it should, no doubt. Yeah, the bearing is super hot. Like, ouch, really hot to the touch. Has a pretty decent groove through the entire thing now. It seems like the bearing just can't handle it. Like, yeah, the bearing really does just seem like it heats up too much. Is there no bearing in these? Let's check on the other one. The plastic was like turned into cotton candy. Yeah, wow. It got so hot. So I sanded it in half and uh, it looks like it's all plastic, which would explain why it doesn't really work after you get it going too fast and heat it up. T -t -t Today, Junior! That's what we get for shopping at Harbor Freight. But now we get a shop at Walmart. Yo! Hey. These ones are metal, so hopefully that will be good. Well, we should try to put it in between the two so that they spin inwardly on one yeah, another. Yeah, that'd be sick. <laughs> that was epic. <laughs> Finally. <we> yeah. <laughs>too far apart for that to work. I don't think these roller blade wheels are great, but the roller skate wheels should work better. Complete bada solid metal should yeah. work good. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada bam. Dan, have you been forgetting arm day? All right, we've secured the roller skate down. We decided to forego the shield on this one because it's too big and we've got a bad old nozzle on here. So if it blows up like in the old video, it'll be all right. it's not solid curse you walmart as you can tell i moved back i kept going this way and that way to try and keep it spinning <laughs> it's all stretched out from having expanded
Well, it flew up in this direction, landed somewhere over there. Wait, over there. Aha! All the way over here, behind the big guy. Behind the green machine. It went up and over that somehow. <laughs> oh, sheesh. Oh. I don't know if I've ever told you guys, but I was actually in the Premier League. Well, I gave it my all. Yo, the lights are still cooking. You can still ride it. It's just a little bumpy. So since it keeps getting disintegrated on this last big one, we're gonna start it and just barely be touching it and move back and forth instead of going deeper and see if that will help it not do what they keep doing. Okay, here goes nothing. <laughs> it knocked over Dan. Oh, the carnage. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what do you think, Craig? It hit that pole right there. Did yeah. it? I think that's what I heard. Is that oh it? my. That's that was, what it was. That was awesome. <laughs> that's exactly what we needed. That's oh, what it, we wanted. look how it separated from the plastic of the core. Just chunks everywhere. Oh, there's a huge oh, yeah. chunk of it. And it totally destroyed the nozzle. Oh. Yes, <laughs> we did it. Oh, what a glorious result. Dan didn't seem impressed. Yeah, Dan didn't seem to care at all. So these high quality bearings and just the overall build quality of this bigger one is why it survived long enough to explode. So that was great. Um, uh -oh. What's going on? So really what we learned is how rare it is to have a wheel that explodes like that. You gotta have a good bearing. Quite the anomaly. The receding hairline really is on point. <laughs> It's receded. 